guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, we're going to be doing a locker review. And I'm going to be showing you all my skins and what I think about them. If I regret them or if I love them and telling you what I think about them. Let's get right into my locker. Hey guys, we're in my locker and the first skin up is Deadpool. Uh, some of you guys might know that Deadpool is my favourite hero. And overall, I just think that Epic Games were really good for adding him in. And I really love this skin. Uh, Blackheart from season eight. I don't really rate him that good, but I've never seen him in game and I never use him. So I'm gonna have to rate him a two out of 10. Catalyst, um, I would say that she's just the female version of Drift. Really copy, I never see anyone else copy as well. I'm gonna have to say three out of 10. Fusion. I like the golden bit of him, and overall he's just a pretty nice and golden skin. Uh, next we got rocks, just a massive no no, zero out of 10. Uh, I got the rose team leader from Save the World, and if you wanna be a sweat, then wear this skin, because I think this would be a sweaty kind of skin. So, on tier 100 in season eight, this was the worst skin to have at tier 100. This has been the worst skin to have at tier 100 in like the whole world of Fortnite. Uh, but I see why they did it, because in season seven, you could have got a free battle pass. Uh, Inferno, I bought this guy for uh, like so much money. Never really cop it, but, and I never really see anyone else cop it. So I'd have to rate it four out of 10. Hybrid, I have him at the top level, and if he's at the top level, he does look pretty dope. He's really, like, I really like his skin. Five out of 10. Maya, if you build her, if you like upgrade her all to the way to the top, I think she'd be pretty good. Like, I'd say nine, uh, eight out of 10, because you can, like, change it different styles. Uh, for Ruin, just a bad skin. Just, like, I'd say, a one out of ten one out of ten chicken guy on the first level horrible zero out of ten second level one out of ten singularity i like that you can change the helmets and stuff to different stuff but i never really like cop it serana um she came out for like a battle pass thing where you could get her and overall She's a pretty good skin, um, in my opinion. And I'd rate her a six out of 10. Scientist, full on zero out of 10. Uh, Vendetta, oh, I don't know. Like, if the highest star is like, I can't, I don't, I'm not feeling it. Like Vendetta, two out of 10. It's, it's a bad skin in my mind. Brutus, I have him as Shadow because he has that cool mask on. People will probably disagree with me. But Brutus, I'd have to rate a six out of 10. Agent Peely, a, a solid 10 out of 10. Mr. Peely. Uh, eight ball versus scratch. I see like that it's been like a bit corrupted, but like, I have to rate this four out of 10. This skin I totally regret buying. It was like 1,500 V-Bucks. And my friend also bought this, so I thought of buying it. It was the worst decision I've ever made. I never see anyone copying it, and I never cop it, certainly. Uh, Dark Bomber, if you're a sweat, have this skin. I usually use this skin. This skin I also got from the Save the World. I got this one from Save the World. This was kind of a sweat skin, but this skin, Two out of ten. Bunker Jonesy, just like also two out of ten. Uh, next one up is Cameo versus Chick. I kind of, I really like the hair. I didn't like unlock the rest of it, but I kind of like the hair and like that is the colours just pop out. So I'm gonna go five out of ten. Demi, I just. I just hate it for some reason. Just, I'm gonna go a zero out of 10 for this skin. Uh, for Ember, I used to rock this all the time. I like that it has fire versus like coldness and stuff, but three out of 10. Uh, this skin, I thought it looked like me when it really didn't. Uh, and I ooh, regret buying it. This skin I didn't buy, uh, but it just like, 
uh, I think you got it from like the Christmas tree back in season, I don't know, like 10 or chapter two, season one. And you can camp in bushes with this and that stuff, but I'm gonna have to say four out of 10. This skin, I, this was my main skin back in the day. I'm gonna have to rate this 10 out of 10. I loved this skin. Clearly, 10 out of 10. Um, Overtaker, eight out of 10 for me. Uh, I do use it sometimes, but not all the time. My house calls, 10 out of 10, look at that buffness. Uh, Mecha Team Leader, I really do regret buying this. I liked it on this color, but after a few days I got fed up with it. So I'm gonna rate it a two out of 10. Uh, Master Key, I really love this, this style. Some people might like the golden style better, but I really like the silver style. Uh, Sidewinder, zero out of 10. Sky, I actually really like Sky because I, I, she has like a built in emote. I'll show you guys real quick. And she like throws the hat off her and makes it like an emote. And she can, she can also do that with her glider. So seven out of 10. Which, uh, no, eight out of 10, because like you can turn the hat into stuff. Uh, Sparkle Supreme. I never rock it, but I think people might like it. So, <sighs> nah, just four out of 10. I don't feel it. Stratus, uh, my friend always used to love this one. Probably because like it was one of his only skins. Uh, but I don't really like it. I'd say six out of 10. Oh, Summer Drift. I I actually really like this one. Uh, which one do you guys like more? With the shirt or no shirt? Uh, but I'm still going to rate this a 6 out of 10. Uh, Tilted Technique. This is kind of a sweaty skin, but kind of not at the same time. So I'm going 4. This just came with PS4, so I'm not really like rating this. Actually, for PS4, I'll rate it 3. Three out of ten. Um, for Ripley vs Sludge, solid ten out of ten. I love these guys. Um, DJ on three, huh, or something. Um, I really wanted to get it crowned, but I didn't. Um, and overall, if I had the crown, I'd rate it an eight out of ten. I don't know what you guys think, but I would. This is two, two. You just like can't do anything with it. You put a jacket on it, nah. Um, Vega. This is the one of the worst skins in Fortnite history, a zero out of 10. I thought that some people liked this, but absolutely no one likes this skin. It's horrible. Uh, next one up is T and Tina. I like her, cause she has a built-in emote, but I'll wear her and show you the built-in emote. Yeah, this. And then it turns her like comic-y style. I don't actually use that yet. I like that, and then it turns her back. Um, so, um, seven out of 10 just for the built-in emote. Uh, Cypric, I, whatever, how you pronounce it. Um, I bought this skin for like 1,500 and I never use it, but it does look kind of sick. I might start wearing a bit more now. So seven, I'd say. Uh, Journey or Hazard. Uh, I actually like the Hazard bit. So, for the hazard, I'm going eight out of 10. For this, two out of 10. Uh, next one up is a sweaty soccer. I always do number like zero or something with England, because that's my main country. And overall, I'd rate this seven or eight out of 10, because I do use this a bit. And B versus Toxin. Uh, oh, oh, I like that she can, oh, I love this style. This is the best style ever. For just that style, I'm gonna rate that solid uh, seven out of 10. For this one, uh, this is literally the one that we saw back up here. It's literally, uh, this came out like a year later after this as well. So three out of 10 because it's got three eyes on it. This one's a four out of 10 now. Uh, 
Turf versus Riptide or whatever. I actually kind of like this on the second style, but on the first style, just no, no. For this, zero out of 10. I just hate the way that it's like brought up and stuff. It's like icy and everything, zero out of 10. If you guys want me to, I'll maybe do like a battle pass tour um, and what I think about them and stuff. Subscribe with post notifications on and I may or may not do that. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Comment down below if you watched all the way to the end. Remember to like, comment and subscribe for more videos. And as usual, goodbye. Hey guys, please like and subscribe so I can get Chaz's locker.